Hey, big news, Ultimate Warrior passed away. Thoughts on him? You, any memories you have of him, or what do you think about the passing of the, the wrestling legend? Man, that's messed up, man. That was my man, too. I stopped watching wrestling when I found out it was fake, you know what I'm saying? But always down with the... <laughs> always down with that man, you know what I'm saying? So, damn, rest in peace, my man. Damn, I hate that. I hate it gone, man. That was, that was one of my favorites, yeah. other than Hulk Hogan back in the day. You know what I'm saying? Ravishing Rick Rule, Roddy Piper, all them guys. But Ultimate Warrior, man, that was our guy, man. Shit, I hate it gone, man. Rest in peace, man. Right. Ugly. Well, let me get you while you're there real quick. Thoughts on Ultimate Warrior passing yesterday? You know what? Uh, it's definitely a legend that's gone. You know, I, I grew up to... When wrestling, I thought it was real. <laughs> it's not like sick. Do you guys practice this together or what? <laughs> you know, he was, he was my hero, him and uh, him and Hulk Hogan. Damn, you know? we said the same. Well, go ahead, get the ropes, start doing yeah. your impression. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> get up. You know? But, uh, you know, it, was, it, it, it definitely, uh, when I read about it, you know, he ain't been in it so long. I don't even follow him in the wrestling. Blah, anymore. blah, blah, blah. Uh, you we know? need you too, so. But, uh, you know, uh, it, <laughs> What I look at is a, it's not about you know the short time that you're here or or the things that you did or people the way they remember you when you're gone. It's the impact you make on people while you're doing what you do, and it made a huge impact not just on me but I'm pretty sure on more than half of the world. Yeah. Rest in peace, Ultimate Warrior, man. You're gonna live on with us, baby, because hey, yes, sir. wrestling was real to us. You was the man. Yeah. Yesterday, thoughts on the passing of the wrestling legend? Oh man, you know he was a legend. He's gone now, but I was a Hulk Hogan fan, so I used to always watch, watch them two guys go at it, and um, it just reminds me of my childhood and stuff. So um, it was sad that he died, but he's a legend, so you know his his name will live, like live on and stuff. So I um, mean, you know, condolences to his family, his friends. But, um, yeah, his name will live on. <laughs> Who the Ultimate Warrior? I don't know who that is. Never heard of him. Not a big wrestling fan growing up? No. So, so you're not saddened by the... I don't, I don't know if I should be sad. I don't know him. But I'm sad by anybody, anybody passing. So, so what was your favorite Ultimate Warrior match? <laughs> I don't know him. Yesterday, thoughts on uh, wrestling legend passing away? Oh man, I, I was a fan of uh, Ultimate War when I was younger. Uh, that's, that's sad, you know. Rest in peace, Ultimate War. Yeah. Thoughts on that's it? Yeah. <laughs> Ultimate Warrior died yesterday. Thoughts on his passing? Oh man, that was that was a, a big loss, you know. Uh, Ultimate Warrior was a great wrestler. I'm, I was a huge fan, and it's a big loss in the wrestling world. But you know, he was a legend. You know, he left us back a lot of memories and. Rest in peace, and my prayers and blessings go to him and his family. You don't hear about as much from from boxers, but you know the wrestlers traditionally they die really young because of the hard life they live. Yeah. You know, wrestling's obviously different; it's scripted, that kind of thing. But it's similar in a lot of ways to boxing. You know, it's it is athletic. It is they work hard, they push themselves every day. Anything that you, you guys take as boxers from wrestlers and the mistakes well, they made where so many of them die so young. Well, uh, um, for one, a lot of wrestlers they're tough. You know, they have a lot of toughness. They they they're sacrificing their body and. In any type of, you know, physical combat sports, you gotta respect somebody, you know, whether it's in the, in, a, in a ring or a cage, whatever. Any physical, you know, abuse or physical fighting is, is you gotta respect it. So, um, it's, it's uh, you know, it's tough, you know, but uh, it's, it's part of the life, you know, it's part of the, you know, what you gotta do is part of your job to, to, you know, beat your body up like that. But obviously it's just, it's just rest, you know, their, their type of uh, combat was, is obviously a little different than ours. But, you know, it's all about resting the body and just taking care of your body. Warrior just died yesterday. Thoughts on the passing of the wrestling legend, guy. I like him as much as some of the some of the legendary fighters. You know, you know, you know, it was all. If it wasn't Hulk Hogan, it's Ultimate Warrior. So when you guys fought, did you guys do the? Oh yeah. When he Ultimate, we always did it. Rest in peace. So which which one was you, know, Hulk Hogan? You were Ultimate Warrior. Yeah, yeah. You should do Ultimate Warrior. Rest in peace. So thoughts on him? Is this you hear about it? You already know. I, yeah, I heard about it yesterday. Yeah, yeah, it's sad, you know. It's a legend in, in the game, so, you know, it's, it's, it's not many like him, so, you know, rest in peace. You know, condolences to his family. I'll tell you this. There wasn't a bigger wrestling fan than me growing up in the, in the late 80s, early 90s. 
I, I lived off of wrestling, and, and I remember one WrestleMania where he came out and he uh, and he beat the Honky Tonk Man in like 30 seconds. He just came out, ran in the ring, picked him up, slammed him, pinned him, and that was uh, one of the highlights of my childhood. And so uh, Ultimate Warrior is always uh, always has a special place for me in my childhood. Now you know what he was a legend. He uh, everybody knows who the Ultimate Warrior is. And, uh, it's sad, and you know, of course, all of our uh, prayers and thoughts and condolences go out to him and his family. And, you know, it's, it's sad, but that's uh, it's part of the sport, man. That's part of life. You know, no one gets out alive, and you just got to count your blessings every single day. But what he left behind was a legacy for sure that, that probably will never be filled. Again. I I don't uh, watch wrestling, but I hear it. I'm really sorry about it. And, uh, and uh, any memories you have of? Man, oh gosh, that's uh, <clears throat> that's sad, man. To be honest with you, I didn't I didn't know about that, and. Uh, I just found out about it just right now, but uh, the Ultimate Warrior, you know, to me, he meant a lot, to be honest with you, because I grew up watching the WWF, and uh, I grew up watching wrestling, uh, you know, main event on Saturday nights, I grew up watching all that stuff, and uh, to a lot of people, they might have thought wrestling was fake or, or whatever have you, but those, those guys were my heroes when I was a little kid, and uh, the Ultimate Warrior, you know, he always brought uh, intensity. You know, he always brought just uh, power and intensity, uh, you know, to the ring. And uh, that's something I'll always remember of him. And, uh, yeah, it's just crazy. But, um, uh, you know, if there's anything I learned from him, that, that was just, uh, just ultimate intensity all the time. And he never got tired. And, uh, you know, people think that stuff is fake, whatever have you. But to me, that stuff meant a lot. And uh, I'll take the good from it. And uh, man, I, I just pray that he would, uh, that he would just, uh, that his family would be, would be uh, uh, comforted in this time. And I just pray for their peace. And uh, uh, you know, for anybody that watches this video, uh, I just pray that they would uh, remember a guy that that uh, that influenced a lot of people. And so, uh, God bless them. Thoughts on, on the passing of the legendary Ultimate Warrior? Oh, I feel so bad. <laughs> <laughs> I can't use that.